Welcome back to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. We are kicking off again with Guardians of the Galaxy. And today will be episode 2. Uh, dos. Uh, de. I don't know how many other languages I can actually remember to say too, but that's all that's hitting me right now. So last time we left off with Quill, Rocket and Groot um, finding potentially an Infinity Stone. Um, but they've encountered some sort of issue on this wreckage, and we're about to venture deeper and deeper into the abyss of this station or creature, whatever you want to call it. Whoa! Oh, fuck yeah! You can just find outfits? Oh, fuck yes! Oh, please say that we get the movie versions of their outfits, because if so, that's going to make this feel a lot better. Um, Alright, let's continue with our buddies. Um, the audio seemed to be alright last time with me versus the game, so I've kept it as is uh, on this one. Um, not played anything else just yet, uh, just because I wanted to make sure that everything sounded alright. Um, for this again, because this seems to kind of have the, the bigger complications out of all the games right now that I'm playing. But I do need to figure out the right volume for Last of Us Part 2. So... <clears throat> Let's get some Harbulary batteries. And... Switch that off. Wait, hold on, what was that? Uh... If you're wondering, and if you did watch the last episode, um, I actually didn't go through and pause anything to read it. I probably should have. Um, but fuck yeah, look at that. Oh, that looks so cool. Alright, where we... Install the last thumper. So it's the one on Groot's hip, I think. It would suck to get busted in here. You know, with just one exit. Is that supposed to make me feel better? Um, okay. Do I have to go back up here? Because that makes sense. I apologize if you can hear the dog in the middle distance. It has been rather loud today and not shut the fuck up. Oh, <laughs> just phased for it. Um, Alright. Let's install the last thumper. Ah! There's a doorway behind that big thing. Someone help me push it. <laughs> Alright. Surely Groot would just be able to handle it on his own, wouldn't he? Because he's the biggest out of us. It just seems a bit weird like, to need to do anything when the Grooty is around. They don't make him sturdy like that no more. Shut hey, come on, up. Well, let's see if this beauty still Some works. Laptop's kicking Maybe off now. Fix up your gear. Hey, hand me that part. Oh, so it's just like The Last of Us. Fuck yeah. All right. Um, available perks are displayed when you activate it. Uh, each perk requires specific components to craft. Okie dokie. Well, no. Alright, what do we got? You have enough components to craft this perk. Hold X to ask Rocket to craft it. Sweet! Negate cooldown period due to element guns overheating. Uh, yes. Alright, it's all yours. <laughs> This is fucking awesome. I like this. Uh, wait, hold on. There's more. Oh, right. Element gun. All perks. Element gun. Suit. Alright. Visor. Wait, what was that? I don't know if that's relevant, is it? Air glide. Glide around targets for a shorter time while shooting. Uh, knockdown. Avoid falling prone 
by dashing when you hit someone. What's that one? Drop additional health pickups when landing a lethal blow. Oh. Attract enemies from far away. Help is on the way, dear! I don't know why that came into my head. If, if you're ADHD, you understand those intrusive thoughts. They generally tend to become audible. So now, I... Do I want to attract enemy drops? Or... Hmm... I mean, attracting enemy, like, drops, so, like, health or whatever, could be pretty useful, but I've only got enough for one more. Um, avoid falling prone by dashing. I feel like, for now, until I really get used to the game, that'll probably be more useful. There we go. Alright. Scanning an enemy provides clues as to how to defeat them. Time slows down while you are scanning an enemy. Oh, nice. Yeah, there's a way through if we can clear out that crud. Let's make this quick. What do you want, Quill? Hang on, I just want to see if there's any enough. more little shiny shinies around and see if I can notch up. Um, I don't think you're gonna find another they, way to uh, count. See if I can just buy one more upgrade. Oh, fuck yeah, there is. How did I miss that? Hey, oh, fuck yeah, I can, I can get all of them. Well, actually, no, not all of them. I can get, um, what was the other one? Fuck, I can't remember what the other one was now. Hang on. Right Rocket, there, you get Barnes your little Snow. fairy butt over here. Uh, right, which one was it that I was looking at? Um, was it the air glide? Yeah, it was the air glide. Come on, Quill, put them pea shooters to good use so we can squeeze in there. Awesome. All right, now I just need to fucking remember. Uh huh. Firing repeatedly causes overheating upon. Overheating, green zones appear on the cooldown gauge. Press R2 with the marker in that zone and it cancels it. Sweet! Oh! That's going to be so much more useful. Thanks for the upgrade. Perfectly safe, right? I don't trust your definition of safe. Oh, that's fucking sweet. I love that. Nope, going down. Ah, fuck it. Uh, what's that? Uh, what is that? Ah! No! I'm not touching that thing. I'm not touching it. Ah, no, I missed the cooldown. Oh, uh, what the fuck is that? Uh, no, 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 no. Oh no, there's more of them! No! No, I missed the cooldown! Ow! Oh no! no. Oh, there's loads! Oh no, I missed the cooldown! Wait, what happened? What the fuck happened? Did it just put me back in this fucking shithole? Oh, I keep missing the cooldown. Ah, right oh, fuck off. You really missed out. That was amazing. Team Rocket. Finally. We couldn't hear you before. Oh yeah, I have an ability like point. Messing up our cause. Yeah, something really ain't right in here. Click Quill and then Whoa, can I stay hovering whilst shooting? Prolonged burn, rising to a tactically advantageous position to give orders. Nice! Self-improvement. 
Oh, so they've all got a natural upgrade. I'm very curious to see what Drax and Gamora can do in a battle. Oh, I really want to unlock some of your outfits. And down another, hole. another one. I'm parking the Milano, but Drax is out there uh. searching. Guys, we really need to get better at the buddy system. She is not my buddy. I will find you, Peter Quill. Describe your surroundings. Uh, old metal, old mining equipment, just old. Noted. Um, where am I going? What a weird bunch of stuff to mine. Uh. What was it? I don't know. Weird QB hunks of rock or metal. That is a fucking awesome feature, the cooldown. Oh, there was something. Whoa. I wonder if Rocket knows what this is. Okay, that's fucking sick. New Guardian collectible. You found a spinal control unit. Peter, make some noise so we can find you. Drax! Drax! Hey, you want to mute your comms if you're going to scream your lungs out? Popularity batteries. Oh, it was already broken. I have located some old equipment, but I do not see you. This whole place is old equipment. It's not there for search. All right, this looks like a battle oh. arena. Oh! Oh, fuck no! Fuck no! Uh, recommend sustained damage to stagger. Oh, why did I just do that? Ah! Filling it completely will momentarily cripple them. Oh, wonderful. So, how long do I have to keep this up? Oh, yay! Oh my god! Drax! Yes! <laughs> it's like Hulk smash! Drax is a durable brawler, able to take on many enemies at once. He specializes in staggering enemies, impervious to regular attacks. His basic ability, Destroy, deals light damage and heavy stagger. Sweet, so I wasn't going to fucking touch that thing at all. Let's make him feel it. Keep hitting the Drax. Nice. Ugh! Fuck a doodle doo. Drax, kill it! <laughs> Please kill it! Gamora! Oh, fuck yeah! Gamora, the deadliest woman in the galaxy. Gamora is a skilled assassin who swiftly... Eliminates targets. She delivers quick, high damage attacks. Her basic ability, Deadly Strike, deals heavy damage to a single enemy. So Drax is more of kind of like the one that breaks down those walls, and then Gamora pretty much finishes them off. That is fucking awesome. I want to make. I want to get an outfit for Rocket that reflects the Guardians movie. Get 
catch up. Just making a uh, pit stop. I parked the Milano near the last thumper spot. We'll head that way and keep an eye out for you. How's my baby? If we can get this thing down, it should get. Let's see that fancy footwork, Gamora. Bet you can't do this. That is physically Damn. impossible. Drax, think you can half that container? Behold the might of a Katathian warrior! Whoa! <laughs> right about there. Understood. All right, this game has just gotten Remember so much moment, better in my estimations. Holy I shit. How slowly you moved. <clears throat> just want to see if there's any uh, glowy glowies. Shit, so we got the whole band together. So Gamora is very capable physically. There we are. Rocket. Not now, Quill. This game has just gotten so much better. They clearly seem to be leaning in on like the teamwork aspect for the Guardians. Don't even know what it looks like. Which, if you Can't haven't seen the third movie thing. yet, uh, big, they lean into very pushed. well in a Probably fight scene towards the end of the movie. Lady Hellbender <clears throat> is a renowned warrior. An ideal specimen would reflect that strength. Like I said, something scary. I disagree. Strength is endearing. With a name like Hellbender, Gamora's probably right. It's gotta be something scary. Nightmarish. A proper apex predator. Snarling and nasty. More teeth than all of us combined. Bat-like wings with razor tips. Probably spits poison or acid. Or acidic poison. I hope all these are true. I yearn for a worthy challenge. This place... I don't know. It just feels... too quiet. Like a church. Or a grave. The two are not mutually exclusive. Uh, again, if I remember, I will read that, but if you want to read it, feel free to pause. The two are not mutually exclusive. They kind of are, Draxy boy. Maybe, I wasn't listening to their conversation. This thing kind of reminds me of this time when my hamster got loose and I chased her all over the basement. Ah, uh, was she a fearsome beast? Yeah, she had a mean bite. Did you guys have pets? I had an eyeball in a jar. It never blinked because it didn't have its eyelids, but <laughs> it always looked like it wanted to. Okay, moving on to Drax. I would much rather discuss the eyeball. It was one of a set. My sister had the other. Oh, come on. Wait, hold on. They wouldn't have bought. Oh, do I have to go back up here? I was wondering why it let me shoot that, but. Is there a sprint function? Oh, no. You know, I've seen these big mining ships before, but I don't remember ever seeing a Tathian starfighter in the war. Manos ordered his invaders to raise most of our fleets and demolish our factories before we could respond. Surely you knew that. Actually, uh, I didn't. I had nothing to do with what happened to your people. But you were familiar with this tactic. I... Yes. Of course you were. Oh, just... I wanted to make sure that I wasn't going to get screwed over on that. Um... Please say there's something good. Oh, yikes! Deliver her prize. Lady Hellbender could become an influential ally. How so? They say that the mere mention of her name. Fuck yeah! All right. You want to turn the Guardians of the Galaxy into an extortion racket? No. I want people to offer us bigger tasks because they fear her wrath. Same thing, Drax. Ah. Let's go, guys. We. Oh, 
Yes, we got the whole gang. Oh fuck! Yikes! <laughs> All right, Groot, you take them. Gamora, you take them. Drax, you take that. Oh fuck! I used the wrong one. Oh no, Rocket! What happened? Rockety, Rockety, Rocket! Shit! What do I do? Ah! Wait, what? Actions you perform in battle build up to your huddle gauge. When filled, call a huddle to reset the odds. Oh, fuck yes. Guys, huddle up! <laughs> it feels like they're everywhere, laughing at us. And yet... Who cannot retreat? No one wants to retreat, big guy, but I gotta say, Choose Clark a speech is scary out there, well. Cool. All right, all right, listen. This isn't our first rodeo, guys. Problem is, if we play it cocky, just one little mistake and they're gonna bring us down. Who's with me? This battle is so much here. the leader, Oh. What? No! It failed? Fine, I guess we're going to be doing this the easy way then. Oh shit! Failed? Alright. Yeah! Sometimes he ain't half bad. Ah, I fucking hate that thing. Rockets on him! Ah! Oh, that is awesome! Alright, yeah, let's use Rocket. Glorious! Bring on our monster! I am engorged with the frump! I'll be right with you, Drax. Do I need two? Shit, do I actually need two? Oh, whoa. Huh. Alright, that's pretty fucking cool. I didn't realise that Pete was, uh... Had a diary. And what's this last one? Galactic Compendium. Oh, so this is like the archives. All right, sweet. Didn't need to hear that. Come on, last bumper spot is this way. How do you know? All right, so the thing, the huddle failed. Even the tiniest vibrations. Really? No, I'm tracking it on my display. All right. Um... Milano should be right on the other side of this door. It was open when I came through here. Who says I tripped on something? Murder mom probably closed the door behind her. It looks like it's still got some juice. Give it a go, Rocket. Watch a genius at work. You are a miracle worker, man. This tech was built by people who make holes in giant floating space rocks. It's almost insulting. Awesome. There she is, the Milano. I have to say, that is an immaculate parking job. Thanos never tolerated imperfection. Never been a problem for Quill. I was so hopeful that I could have jumped on that then. Uh, right. Let's go, group. Yeah, yeah. We're into a cinematic. This is it. Last spot. I am Groot. Can't wait to be out of here. This place feels like it's about to collapse on itself. I cannot wait to meet our monster. I thought you were mostly interested in meeting the buyer. 
She is a respectable collector. Is it working? Yeah, yeah, don't worry, sunshine. <laughs> Is it, uh, doing it? What? <laughs> it appears to be broken. Ain't nothing broke. That's the sound it's supposed to make. What sounds? You can't hear that. Hear what? Oh. Whoa. Is that? Our monster has arrived. I see it. Good. Oh, crap, the door we <laughs> that works. Let's catch our monster. Nice work, group. Man, that thing is fast. Don't Shit. let it get behind you. It could be poisonous. Lady Hellbender will pay us. Whoa, it looks like a llama. Where's it gone? This beach oh, shit. is proving formidable. That's good news, right? Beans is worth something. Now's your chance, Gamora! That's one less thing to hide behind. Good thinking, well. Alright, let's take away its advantage to be able to hide. Damn it, I keep missing the cooldown. Alright. Get a group! Yeah, it looks like a llama. Llama! I was right! What the flark is that? Definitely not a monster. Adorable. It's more matted than an Asgardian goat. We cannot present this pathetic creature to the monster queen of Sektorf 9. She will laugh at us. Maybe we can use it as bait. I knew those thumpers wouldn't work. Is Groot gonna keep it as a pet? My thumpers are state of the art. Musclehead's the one who rushed at the first thing that came through the door. My head is. That is a weird llama. What the? His people are completely literal. Uh. The Milano? Is it okay? You guys seeing what I'm seeing? Oh. It's a space whale yes. dragon. Now that is a monster. A canty? What the fuck is that? Alright. Enough with the warm up. Time to catch us a real monster. <laughs> Let's get. Through. Groot, do you want to put the fucking llama down? Whoa! What in hell's name is that? Definitely not cleaner bots. Whoa! Watch it! Whole place is crapping out. We gotta get out of here now. Curse these volatile ruined tracks. Go! <laughs> Holy shit! <gasps> I get to control the Milano. Hold on to your butts, people. Rocket, Whoa! Watch the ship. I'm watching, I'm watching. You ain't! Drax, what are you doing? I am Whoa, holding my shit. Are oh, you trusting me with this? Someone give me a hand. Am I right? <laughs> uh this is kinda close. Heads up! I have already been firing these guns. Okay, this place is falling That's apart. It. This was a bad idea. He has sensitive nipples. Yikes. Uh. You want me to take 
I'm destroying my shit. Watch it. get us killed, Quilt. There's still so much stuff I want to steal. Ah, fuck. We ain't gonna make it. Hit the blue button. What blue button? The one for the secret boosters I added. Can you please stop that? Oh, shit. Punch it, Peter. Now is not the time for hand to hand combat. Fuck. Yeah, definitely a fan of the blue button. They're scot on all sides. We ain't gonna make it. Make it, baby. Here's the exit. See, hope stretch. No last breath. And what's gonna get in our way? Yeah, and that's what I call a win, people. How's that a win? Our monster just got eaten. Whatever you can fly away from means you screwed up because you had to fly away from it. Whoa. What the fuck happened? Don't be Nova Corps, the fuck? Don't be Nova Corps, please don't be Nova Corps. A risky gamble. <laughs> Holy shit, so that was like the first episode, just barely half the intro. Hala's Hope. That's a patrol ship. Nova Corps? Designation? Hala's Hope. Uh, did you say Hala's Hope? Um, <clears throat> there's a, a, a thing I got I gotta do. I'll, I'll be right back. <laughs> we need to get rid of that animal. Now. <sighs> I'm serious, Peter. If it stays on the ship, we all go to prison. No one's going to jail. It's a harmless space llama thingy. Harmless? Remember Anakubi? Uh, not really, no. That's because they scorched the planet because an idiot smuggled in an Exelon. I will eject the beast into space. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. <laughs> eject the animal make us look guilty. It could be carrying Zephron's disease. Which is why Drax is uh -oh. going to hide in the secret cargo compartment behind Groot's plants. Peter. Jason. Quill. Hey, Corell! How you doing? How long's it been? Two, three years? You look good. You been tanning? This is a new low, Peter. Even for you. Corell, I swear it's not what it looks like. That you're a junker trespassing in the most restricted area of space? Who consorts with thieves and murderers, apparently? Hey, killing people for money ain't murder, lady. Nice to see you too. Right. Peter Quill, I found these items in the uh, space that you told me about. There was not enough room for both the other thing and these. Peter Quill of Planet C-53, under Galactic Law ZXB-47, I am putting you and your crew under arrest for Actually, can I call you back? What? <laughs> Please tell me that is not a crate of super illegal tech. It is a crate of super illegal tech, which also happens to be very valuable. Really? What? We're on a Ravager ship. Even the Flark and Bulkheads are stolen. Well, we can't fit both in the compartment. I will eject the crate into space. Eject the crate, and I melt your face! <laughs> the Milano's <laughs> weapon systems are four generations behind, Quill. We need that tech. More than we need some stupid farm animal. That farm animal could be a class three biohazard. Do you want to end up in the kiln? Hide the creature, hide the tech. Uh... Uh, no! I didn't choose! shouldn't have hung up on her. What about the crate? Leave it. I'll handle this. Krell and I have history together. You slept with a They cop. do not give you long enough to decide. I wasn't a cop at the time. The point is, I will get us out of this. Trust me. Pretty cool ship. Just speak to Centurion Corral. Silence, prison. There's no time to meet with law-breaking pirates like you. That's just it. We're not pirates. We're legally incorporated heroes for hire. Yeah, that's right. You check those records, Buckethead. 
Novacore licensing permit 67398-2. Gardeners of the galaxy? <laughs> no. Rocket. Is that like this game's equivalent of, uh, if it isn't Star Prince? Most well-known heroes you could hire, but definitely in the top five of most awesome names. Contributing members: Groot, a Flora Colossus, last of his kind, fearless in a firefight, an awesome best friend. Rocket, bona fide super genius and a wizard with explosives, definitely not a raccoon. <laughs> Gamora. Adopted daughter of Thanos, deadliest woman in the galaxy. Need we say more? Drax the Destroyer, convicted serial murderer and galactic war hero. Often grumpy. Often grumpy. Last and definitely least, Peter Jason Quill. <laughs> That's all you wrote? It was a character limitation. <sighs> Sorry, excuse me, I just need to... <laughs> That gold. What are you doing here? Oh, you don't know? Really? It says right here. Prisoner processing training. I'm your official trainee. Aren't you a little young for the core? Aren't you uh -huh. a little old for that hairdo? I should check with the captain. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. She, she definitely signed off on this. You know how thorough she is about signing stuff? If I may, sir? Their real concern here is Regulation 7A regarding prisoner footgear. That one's jet boots are in clear violation. They're decorative. <laughs> Good work. They look like Iron Man's boots. Great. There goes Plan B. You don't need a Plan B. I got this. No, you do not got this, pirate. I got this. Now fall in line. Go, oh, son of a shit biscuit. Ninja Turtle, you better stop hitting me. All memorized, sir. First thing we do First thing you do is apologize. We're legitimate business like folk on legitimate like business. We're not hunting an illegal creature in illegal space. There's so much wrong with this arrest. A, no way a kid should be. I'm an official trainee. And B, I'm very, very close friends with the captain. Uh, hold it right here. Is there a problem? Yes! No faith energy, no power. No power. No container. Are they gonna work a deal? Oh, a single spot. The techs are looking at it. They say that. They cannot even fathom. How can they fix what they cannot understand? Put the Grand Unifier's mind at ease. Run the scanners again. What the flark is a Grand Unifier? Grand Unifier Breaker. Leader of the Church of Universal something he was floating dead in the quarantine zone looking for god let's go we caught him just like we caught you difference is i know the captain as i was saying if you just tell the captain that i mom explicitly said she doesn't want to see you yeah quill wait did she just say mom just to be super clear on the mom oh shit Oh fuck! Quill, what are you doing? Oh shit! Oh, I forgot. It's one of those ring things. You have to, you have to time right. Shit! Please give me a do-over for that. Pretty please. Pretty pretty please. Give me a do-over. So far, this game has been a lot of fun. It's a lot of cinematics, but really good time. Yes, I got a do-over. Heroic. There we go. Oh, fuck. Nikki. Oh, it's nice to meet you, Nikki. 
Oh, fuck. Okay, Nikki, here's the plan. You're gonna jump and grab my legs while I hold on for dear life. <laughs> that doesn't sound like... Trust me, kiddo. We got this. All right. See? This is risky shit. He's not letting you complete it because he's supposed to be holding on for dear life. That was gonna be amazing, huh? <laughs> Alright, make a friend. Thanks. Mom wouldn't be impressed if I lost my first prisoner. Really? Oh, Mom, right. Come on. We need to get out of here. There's a glass door around the corner. We'll be safe there. Here. Help me with this. Ready? Together. On three, two, one. Go, go. Okay. Maybe you want to release the handcuffs there, Let's Nikki? Yeah, Nikki. Whoa. Just stay close. I knew there was something wrong about that church. Who goes fishing for God in a junkie? This is bad. Just give me a sec. Come on, come on. You no, know, I could probably help with the door if we undo these cuffs. Regulation 3B. Never undo restraints. Come on, you clearly need my help. No, you're my prisoner. And I got this. <sighs> Obviously. Ah! Okay, we're gonna have to find another way. Whoa! Yikes! Okay. Yeah, I'm fine. You? Oh, she seems really Danny. lovely. Why not okay. just? This way. Should we be going up? Back toward the others? There's another blast door down here. Oh, we establish. You just walk through fire. Are you kidding me? Relax. You're fine. Ish. I mentioned how usual my jet boots will be right now. Okay. Give me or anything. Almost there. Yes! Got it! Through here! Woo! <laughs> nice work. Thanks. You didn't do too bad yourself. Pirate. Only Star Lord. <sighs> or Peter or Not a know, pirate. Nova Cadet butt saver. Okay. Peter. So listen. I have some good news. It's some bad news about your friends. Uh, start with the bad, I guess. Your friends have been processed and put in the brig. So what's the good news? They're not dead. One of them actually seems really active. Come on. Flark! Pipes must have burst. Should we try using that thingamajig of yours to call someone? We don't need help. I know what I'm doing. Now help me block this fire so we can get through. Sure. Uh, sure. Everyone must be worried. How easy does it? Is that just gonna blow it up? There, see? You don't need to worry about me. Enough people around here do that already. For what it's worth, I think you're doing great. As good an arresting officer as I've ever had. Are you serious? I want to see if there's any collectibles. Sneak away on me right now? You literally just said I was doing great. You are doing great. Top five best arresting officers I've <gasps> ever had. A new outfit. So can you please just show me the same respect you would any other arresting officer? <laughs> That's exactly. Whoa. What Holy shit. <laughs> Maybe if I go in disguise. Whoa, all right, that looks weird. Unbelievable. Yeah, I get that a lot. What do you think of my new look, though? Nikki? Nikki, Nikki, Nikki! Nikki! Hey, is that robot wearing makeup? What? Oh, yeah. That's just, it's... I, um, I know all the bots down here. They're kind of my friends, I guess. I reprogrammed most of them. You gave them faces. Maybe. No, I mean it's cool. Give them personality. Very cool. Come on. This way. 
Okay. We work with you, Nikki. Just blatantly gonna ignore me and go crawling into a dead end. Well, it's not like I can leave. Prisoners must stay close at all times. You really got them all memorized, don't you? Any day now. Does your mom You're very unified as an officer, Probably aren't you? Not. But what else am I gonna do? Not like there's any other kids on board. You know, I didn't have a lot of friends at your age either. Granted, I was in prison, but still. So mom was right about you. It was a Shatari prison. I was just a kid. I have so many questions. That outfit is really fucking dorky. <laughs> nah, sorry Pete. You gotta go back to the original. There we go. How do you know my Legendary mom, Outlaw. Uh, we fought together on Mercury during the war. She was, a, is, a real spitfire. More like real controlling. And bossy. And judgmental? You're just a kid, Nikki. You don't know what's good for you, Nikki. Stay out of the escape pods, Nikki. <laughs> I kind of know what you mean. You do? This is a new low, Peter. Even for you, Peter. It's restricted space, Peter. <laughs> yep. That's her. <laughs> Which way did she go? I'll be right with you, Nikki. We're bonding, alright? Don't forget that. Just making sure this place is safe and secure from the, you know, fire. This way. Yeah, could you that way? Try All right. To keep up? I'm still in charge here, you know. It's a dead end. Trust me. Of course I trust you. Quick reminder that only one of us knows the way out. Could have fooled me. <laughs> This is an attempt to escape your mom's ship. I really need to know because I may or may not be super interested. Just <laughs> really need to make sure it doesn't look like a kidnapping. What? No, no. Just, just promise you won't tell anyone about this place. Oh, wow. Don't laugh. No, no. This is cool. It's like your secret hideout, right? Definitely prefer this to the brig. Nice. We're not staying. I just need to check on Ultimo. His gyros have been all screwy. Take your time. Is this your mom? Single-handedly winning the war? Obviously, I know she didn't do it by herself. No. That final push was, uh... It was a massive team effort. Were you there? Uh, I contributed to the war effort... differently. Pirating? Raiding. Which is, you know... The good kind of pirating. Is this Krilar? Uh, yeah. Long time ago. Kid stuff. I could do it way better now. No, no, it's good. Morbid, but good. <laughs> hey, this is Mercury, right? Uh-huh. It's supposed to represent this big battle Mom was part of. You said She's you a very good artist. Right? Oh, yeah. Damn. Your mom was dead in the water until me and the Ravagers showed up. You should really fix this. You want me to draw you in? In the interest of historical accuracy. <laughs> Something tells me you and Rocket would get along. Or really, really not get along. One of those two. The raccoon thing? Yeah. He seemed real charming. I just mean he's also really into all this tech stuff. Hey! Secret stuff. Off limits. No okay. doubts. I get it. Anyway, I'm all done here. We right. probably get back I thought you had collectibles. That was all. Freaks. Yeah, I've seen your mom overreact before. It's like, I'm not a kid anymore, you know? Tell me about it. <laughs> More crawling. Yay. She seems really endearing, but clearly very naive. So I like her, though. You get where I'm coming from, right? Like, if you do end up talking to my mom, the subject of me happens to come up. Because the truth is, I wasn't exactly supposed to. Say no more. I'll make sure Corel knows what a good job you did. No. I mean, thanks. But ideally, Mom never needs to know I was in the hangar at all. So I never saw you? Exactly. Never saw me. Never saw my passkey. You may have heard of Nikki Gold and how cool she is, but that's it. Need a hand? Yes. Got it. Mom? Uh... I can explain. Uh oh. 
Mother! Nikki, I'm fine. Mom, seriously, A-okay, barely a scratch. What in Hall's name were you thinking? Sneaking out with an arresting squad, running around with criminals. Alleged criminals. You almost died. Do you have any idea how rounded you are right now? Mom, you promised to give me more leeway. Leeway doesn't mean lying to my officers or sneaking around behind my back. Look, it's my fault some guy's ship blew up. Restricted areas are restricted for a reason. You treat me like a prisoner. You're a child. Are you even listening? Whoa, whoa. We've all been through a lot today. Let's just all take a deep breath and recognize that maybe we've all made some mistakes. Make sure the fire is out and the hangar secure. Yes, Commander. And find out why that churchman's shuttle exploded. Grand Unifier Raker has been less than cooperative. Make him cooperate. And you two? With me. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I knew you'd overreact. You always overreact. Even Peter was saying so. Oh, he was, was he? I suspect Peter misspoke, something he often tends to do. For what it's worth, Nikki totally saved my butt. She handled herself really well. You have every reason to be proud of her. Coming from you, Peter, it's worth extraordinarily little. Why are you being mean to him? Just listen to what he's saying. I don't care what he's saying. Upper level, captain's quarter. Fine. Initiate lockdown. Lockdown initiated. <laughs> Gonna be one of those daughter redemption stories, Plus, isn't it? In theory, these doors don't open until I say so. Yeah. I know how lockdown works. I don't think you do, because somehow you keep bypassing every security measure on this ship, and I want to know how. Or you can just show me. Ma um. <laughs> I seriously have no idea what you're talking about. I think your mom might be on to you. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> on to you about what? I don't know. I'm stuck in an elevator with crazy people. No one leaves until you tell me what I want to know. You already know everything. No, I don't. I know you're a magnet for danger, and that you somehow keep getting caught in restricted areas of this ship. I'm small. Okay, I fit into places. Being small doesn't get you past security, or through the uh, hangar bay checkpoint, or the maintenance tunnel. I want to stay door. friends with Nikki, actually. There was that system-wide glitch, remember? Yeah. Yeah, security was down for a while. No, it wasn't. Seemed pretty down to me. Are you seriously lying for a 12-year-old right now? 12? Oh, wow, I thought she was at least 16. 12-year-old? What? Like, she really knew her Damn, you get him starting young. Kid. Too smart. She keeps bypassing security. Unless you have a level 6 access to my ship all of a sudden? Didn't think so. Nicolette Gold, empty your pockets. No. You empty your pockets. Nikki? What? I know you're hiding something. I still have feelings for you. Excuse me? Not It's like the best option. Feelings, <laughs> feelings, more like emotions. You know, because of the explosion and me and you and everything we went through back in the war. It was a lot of feelings to pull up. I'm good now. Okay, good. Now, if you don't mind. do that to be continued disengage log down lockdown disengage so can i go help secure the hangar now no you can go back to your quarters and you can stay there for the next 30 rotations but mom i can make it 30 cycles So, rough day, huh? Exploding shuttles, quarantine zone trespassers, missing kid. I have no idea. Chewy. Chewy! I can't believe you still have him. The fuck? Can't believe you survived. Mercury was what, like a thousand degrees? More like a thousand cycles ago. You can keep him if you want. He is yours. 
Hey, I ordered him to look out for you. Expect him to keep doing his job. Especially, you now have a daughter, apparently. That's really cute. Twelve-year-old daughter, who you didn't have during the war. How insane would that be? When we picked up your ship, part of me was excited. At first. But then after all this time, you haven't changed. At all. You're still the same. I've changed. Whatever the fine is, I'll pay. Just give me three cycles. Let me prove that I'm not still... Whatever it is you're going to finish that sentence with. You're going to pay 9,000 units in three cycles. Wow, that, okay. That is a lot of money. Look, here, I was thinking that the maybe... The fine's non-negotiable. My search party found a disturbing amount of prohibited tech lying around your ship and a class 2 biohazard. I couldn't decide which one to hide. Peter. Okay, okay. You'll get your money on time, no problem. This Guardians of the Galaxy thing, we are this close to getting it off the ground. And if I didn't have these handcuffs on... Terribly sorry about that, folks. If um, I missed are. anything, I literally heard someone come up the steps and I had to mute, <clears throat> mute my audio because there was someone at the door. So if the doorbell went, that would have been a pretty horrendous sound. So I'm pretty sure I just missed a prompt for something. Damn, what did I miss? I literally couldn't fucking pause You've it. Like, I had no cycles, no room to do anything. Four, so I had to five, literally mute three. the fucking audio and just run. Contact me when you've got the units. And if we don't? The device we installed will deactivate your ship. And you will all go to prison. Gotcha. We won't let you down. You could get us out of this. I so I guess the best option worked out then. Small price. Nine thousand units. That is a tremendous sum. Where are we gonna get that kind of money in three cycles? By robbing a freaking bank. What are you dressed okay. in, Gamora? So we got fined. So we have a Nova tracking thing on our ship that's gonna shut down our engines if we don't pay that fine in three cycles. At least we're not on a prisoner transport. Not yet. Oh, come on, guys. You're Drax the Destroyer, man. You killed Thanos. Allegedly. What? Are you gonna let a little fine slow you down? And Gamora, Seriously? Practically an MI6 agent, but way hotter and, and cooler. There's nothing you can't do. Here it comes. Rocky, you're an actual genius and the scrappiest dude I know. How many prisons did you break out of? Twenty-two. Oh. You are Groot. Guys, we're supposed to be a team. All we need to do is figure out how broke we are and come up with a plan. So check your quarters. Check between the sofa because check under the crafting. I want to go back through and like once this is finished and units lying around see what the option was because I imagine there was a prompt course. that I missed. I was literally gone for like a minute. All right. This is why you don't sleep with cops, Quill. They put bombs on my ship. My ship. <sighs> Damn. All right. I am watching you, Rodent. Chapter three. What's that supposed to mean? It is common knowledge that rodents hoard nuts, stolen technology, <laughs> units. <laughs> okay. First off, I ain't a hoarder. The broken nor translation a device can now be discussed in Groot's room. All right. Fetch it. Now there ain't nothing to fetch. Groot blew our stash on Contraxia, and the rest I gave to Quill and Gamora for the DAS quarantine zone access code. A likely story. Why don't you go bother someone else? <laughs> I intend to. <laughs> All right. Um, so yeah, I apologize about that final bit with Quill talking to Ro Kel Kel Corel Corel. I think. Um, yeah, I apologize about that. If I did miss a prompt, it was literally it was either I, I stick with it there. or I let you hear the doorbell, and it would have been excruciatingly loud. So. Um, that is going to do it for this episode, though, everybody. Thank you so fucking much for tuning in. It means the absolute world if you do. 
Uh, leave a like on this video and subscribe to keep up with all of my playthrough of the Guardians of the Galaxy and Last of Us Part 2 and Ghost of Tsushima and Star Wars The Clone Wars Republic Heroes. There is so much going on this channel and also remember to check out my main channel Fitz's Thoughts and subscribe over there for my weekly reviews and coverage of Star Wars The Clone Wars, Star Wars Rebels, Ben 10, a couple of movies, video essays on occasion there's a lot going on so please definitely do subscribe as i said uh, leave a like as it really does help things out more than you know and until next time everybody take care and i will see you soon